Hi guys, welcome to the Savvy Money Show. Me, your host Sean. If you find any of today's entertainment helpful, don't forget to smash the lovely like button. It helps with the YouTube algorithm and getting the video out to more people. If you haven't subscribed already, don't forget to hit the red subscribe button and bell notification. You'll be notified when a new video gets uploaded. If you're looking for a free trading platform in which to trade your stocks and shares, don't forget to check out the links in the description below. You'll get a free share worth up to £200 for signing up and depositing a small amount. Free trade only requires a £1 deposit. The others require a £100 deposit or dollars depending on which app you choose. I use all of them. They're all good apps. Now, I want to say thank you for giving up your precious time to watch this video. And I want to say thank you to all my subscribers. The support has been amazing. On with the show. We've got earnings. Uh, um, we're going to start with Winnebago. They have had a bit of a pullback recently because they expect earnings to be negative 30 cents a share. Uh, I don't see why. No, I mentioned them before, and if you had played it when I said, You'd have got in at confirmation here at 50 and driven it up to 68. Now, you've got a little bit of a pullback. Uh, if you wait until the pullback f finishes, I would, uh, if you wait until the pullback finishes, I would wait until it comes down a couple of dollars, but I'd get in and ride the run up pre anticipatory run up uh, before earnings, and I think it will blow through earnings. I mean, you only have to look at it 30 grand a week RV rentals, you know, an RV boom, Nike and Winner Bay goes are winners. Why wouldn't I think they would either break even per share or? they would be and they would go positive so I think this is one where the analysts are wrong again um, let's go right eight. now this is one it's going to be a 50-50 purely because yes they are a chemist stock problem is they are the problem is that they are a type of stock would have had to spend a lot of money to make things safe so they may just come in at earnings or they may blow through it I, I think this is one that I'd wait until earnings to do I wouldn't trade the earnings this is one McCormick and company now I think this is one that will crash earnings it's, it's got a, having a pullback and we know from Simona and Krug that uh, home cooking is back you know especially with people working from home I I think this is one to look into as well now uh, Nike we have a bit of a pullback there I recommended it at $80 a share I, I think this will do well in earnings. I think this will be earnings, but some of that is already built in. But I think it's, as I said before, it's over a hundred dollars a share worth. Uh, now, nah. this is one no one's. Oh, well, there's a very few looking at. It's has earnings this week on Thursday they have doubled their fleet size now if you look at the market cap of 50 million dollars they only have to sell one of their ships to make that I think this is another one that is going to beat earnings and I think this could do incredibly well I think if we're lucky it could hit a dollar 
but this uh, remember this is a penny share and it's very incredibly low price it could end up tanking it could end up going to zero and so I wouldn't go too heavy on that one anyway I hope you've enjoyed today's show and I hope you uh, remember to leave like and subscribe oh there is one more I was going to do a separate one about it if you want me to I will Genius Brains has earnings on Thursday now I haven't got the information at hand to speak about it I haven't managed to get enough information about how well it's doing as I said in the past video it's uh, difficult to actually locate the uh, streaming service that's needed to stream the episodes so it's difficult but what I can say is someone has bought a million shares you have uh, the fact that they're coming out with a movie for Arnold Schwarzenegger and possibly another spin-off series you also have a lot of short sellers and remember when I said about the tanker stocks if you have too many short sellers in putting naked puts in then you end up with all you need is a tiny rise in price and they start panicking and end up having to buy at any price and they drive the price up purely because uh, they're worried they will end up having to pay too much to cover their puts but that is uh, something to consider sorry I can't give more information on that but uh, until more information is out it's a wait and see and I'll see you in the next video goodbye